It's very strange taste. It's really strong for a white wine, which is unusual to begin with. It's yeah. not fresh. It's kind of musky. I suppose I'd describe it as a Portuguese winter by the seaside. It's kind of mouldy and musky and <laughs> just unpleasant. Really. So that's my, my kind of assessment of it. It's really a bad wine. I mean, I've had a lot. <laughs> We're fortunate enough to get quite a few homemade wines, and I've never had anything homemade that comes close to being as, yeah. as just unpleasant to drink. I had, been, I had been walking back to the wine store with it for sure because I, I don't accept that from anything. Really? No, I know you're right, but it has got a lovely box, which I've still decided oh, to keep. So that's, that's why yeah. I'm Michael, Michael, tell us about that. Now, now, from what you were gathering, probably, and what we were saying about the wine club before, we wouldn't dream of taking a wine back because we didn't well, like it. Is that okay in wine just, cycles? You just put the cork back in, and you take it back, through whatever it is, a glass out of it, you just take it back and tell them that this wine is off, mm -hmm. and they will never argue with you. Well, a good... A good store should never argue with it. We've, we've had discussions around the world with, with um, wine stewards. Who, you know, we've sent wine back. Wow. And some very expensive wines. And the sommelier will come along. And there's only once where a sommelier has ever said, oh, I don't think it's wrong. That was in Chile. Yeah, um, but I still refuse to pay for it. This is a seventy-dollar bottle of wine. But that's not the point. The said, point is, it's wrong. Almost without exception, it they'll take it back. They'll take it back. Well, that's going to be a little snippet. I, I'm, I'm going to trim that out of tonight's wine tasting because I think that's really interesting information and it tells you something, I guess, about somebody's grasp of the wine world, doesn't it? I'd never thought, I would never think of doing that. I would take, oh, yeah. I would think it was my take fault. It back in and take it back. Well, Michael, what percentage, Michael, of wine is, is off in court? 10% of all wines that have a cork. Which is, my, have... which is most... Uh, Portuguese wines. Oh, just about all of Portuguese yeah. wines, except the screw. Yeah, right. Yeah. And, and the cartons. 10% of all yeah. wines with a cork. And it was worse about 10 years ago because there was an impression. Oh, Did you know that? Nope. But those wines are off to some extent. Some of them, it's as simple as they're just oxidized because the cork's dried or it was a bad cork. And yeah. you'll put your nose in it and instantly. We were, we were somewhere um, not too long ago, we had visitors from Germany. We were in a restaurant. I think it was at the, down at the um, okay. The matter, matter. But we opened the they opened the wine and they poured it and uh, and said, "There's something wrong with this." And I put my nose in it right away. I called them back and said, "This wine is gone. It's off." And they took it away and brought us a new one. The new one was perfect. But the other thing is, if you are going to the same wine store, they will first of all appreciate knowing that that was the case appreciate mm. getting the opportunity to fix it and also begin to know more about you and what uh your interest and in, taste level in the wine <coughs> is, so that they can match you to the wines they know you will like and so all of that even if it's the uh, characteristics of the wine and you don't like it take it back i still take it back to uh, continental a little yeah you know. Very interesting. Well, this one we got from an expensive wine store. No, I'm not going to take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm more likely. I'm, I'm sorry. We're so British that I feel very bad about complaining about anything in Portugal well, in general. Well, except and, you I, did. You complained on this show, which is publicity for that that wine. And that is true. Yeah. Yeah, That's yeah. yeah. We would never it's dream of doing it to the person to, whose feelings we might. Going to, if you're going to yeah. complain, complain to the person who could make a difference about it. Well, I never. Nice. There you Very go. Cool. That's the difference, isn't it, yeah. between the various sides of the Atlantic? Most wine shops uh, want to know if the want to know if the wine is bad. Take it back. Works in California and in France.